Welcome to the Light Review Prospectus for 2021. The first question, I guess, is uh, who are we? Well, we're an online lighting magazine dedicated to one simple thing, and that is good lighting. The real challenge, of course, is how we actually achieve that. We're different. Unlike many magazines, we are all practicing in the lighting industry. So we have a current and up to date understanding that allows us to promote the best there is in lighting design and manufacture. We care and we're trusted because we know the real consequences of bad practice from first hand experience. The publisher and editor, John Bullock, is a renowned journalist and lighting designer with experience in manufacture as well as the contract business. He is also a regular speaker at lighting conferences and events. So what do we do? We attract people to the light review by providing targeted, up-to-date, rolling commentary of things that matter in lighting today through our articles, blogs and podcasts. Our customers are those who use, commission, design and manufacture lighting. We do more than keep abreast of latest codes and standards. We cover a wide range of lighting related topics to give us the broadest possible reach from architect to electrician. And through our website, we promote lighting designers in the designers gallery where their most prominent projects are featured, increasing footfall to the site and providing a seamless link between specifier and maker. These are tough times for the lighting industry. Uncertainty in product quality and the pernicious effect of value engineering means that everyone suffers from specification switching and substandard product. Designers lose control of their project vision and good manufacturers lose out to cowboys. The Light Review benchmarks the best in lighting, showcasing only those companies with the most reliable and robust lighting manufacturing techniques. We are trusted and as a trusted subscriber to the Light Review, so are you. So what do you get? Promoting your business. First of all, let's look at the manufacturer's library. The Light View provides you with shelf space in the manufacturer's library. If you've been accepted into the manufacturer's library, that means that your company meets our values and required standards. Not everyone is welcome. We design and produce content that best suits your needs, highlighting your company as one that operates at the highest level of product quality. And here we see a screen grab of what the manufacturer's library looks like. Three headlines for each manufacturer. There is of course a homepage which carries all the contact, contact details. There are articles, it's the written content, and there are the podcasts, which is the audio and or the video content as well. And within the articles and within the podcast, there's a wide variety of what that actually means in terms of what we're talking about. We're a marketing platform, not an advertising space. We don't do advertising. What we're looking for is engagement with good quality manufacturers who have something to say as well as something to sell. It's a simple monthly subscription model, 300 pounds a month plus that is all it takes. They'll be happy to accept an annual subscription payment if you prefer. And that's just the start of the story. Promoting your business, we enable you to support and enable sales, grow traffic to your website, convert contacts to customers, increase revenue from existing customers, improve the ROI on your targeted marketing activities, and reduce costs of lead generation, new contacts, new customers. Here's a slide that dates to last year, so pre-coronavirus. Um, the intention of this is, is to indicate that the percentages of people engaging in online marketing activities is getting higher all the time. And it will be interesting to see what happens in 2021, to see what happens to those figures post-coronavirus, when we've all been obliged to learn an awful lot more about uh, our online presence and our online marketing. We have additional services. Video production. Well, videos and online conference calls that were once outliers in our day-to-day -day activity are now front and center. And we've learned that these things don't have to be expensive to produce. The Zoom platform has created a simple route to online presentations 
And we rarely charge for a straightforward conversation between a few people. That comes within the £300 per month subscription. More complex productions mean more time spent on preparation, recording, editing, and that necessarily is charged as an additional service. But talk to us about what it is you're looking for, because who knows, it might be cheaper than you think. Copywriting. The Light Review is able to offer top quality copywriting services for subscribers to the library. John Bullock is a practicing lighting designer as well as publisher and editor of The Light Review. He has a global reputation as a thought leader within the industry and is known for his insightful commentaries. His aim is to make manufacturer content interesting and unique. Chris Fordham is the design voice of The Light Review, producing content on all things designerly, and he's a regular contributor to the podcasts on The Light Review, as well as producing feature articles on light creators and lighting design issues. For promotional talks, the Light Review can provide an independent voice within the industry. When manufacturers approach an audience of specifiers and end users, an independent voice can be an important factor in convincing those potential clients and customers that there are important things that they need to be aware of, whether that be new technology or changing standards. Talks can be online, recognising the impact that pandemic teleconferencing has had on our working life or from a physical conference platform. And we welcome the coming of that day. For conference planning, while the Light Review is an exercise in online publishing, it's also a conduit of information, knowledge and experience. Knowledge is the lifeblood of the lighting industry and it's crucial that we retain a connection with industry experts and technology developers. Online conference planning calls for a different approach to the typical day spent in a lecture theatre, as attractive an option as that may be. The Light Review is planning its own online conference programme. It's a strategy that can also work for individual manufacturers. And targeted marketing. The Light Review is now partnering with Cat's Eye Media to offer enhanced marketing support for the SME lighting sector in the UK. For subscribing companies to the Light Review, Cat's Eye Media can provide practical support in developing marketing strategies, generating sales leads, regular analysis of marketing activity. Katrina Sutcliffe understands how SME businesses work. Resources are tight and time is never enough. And that's why one of her major offers is to manage social media content through LinkedIn, etc., tailored to a company's needs. So what about the designer's gallery? Well, it's a directory service. The Light Review provides lighting design companies with, with a geographical directory and a gallery of projects of their choosing. This is open to all fee charging and non-supplying design practices within the UK and area and is offered at no cost. With some of the biggest consultancies already involved, this is a great way to keep good lighting all under one roof and to bring together the best in design with the best in manufacture. And here we see a screen grab of the designer's gallery and the Google mapping of where those designers are. Project examples. Each designer is, is, a, is a given a gallery space um, to fill with project information. And we are happy to maintain that for them and to have a, as, as active a churn around of, of, des, of design projects as, as, they're, as they're able to give us. We also feature young designers through the lighting tree. And this is a, this is a self perpetuating um, exercise. I, I do not choose the young designers for the lighting tree. The young designers choose the, light, the designers for the lighting tree. So it is an ongoing thread of people recommending other people. If you'd like to contact The Light Review, the website is www.thelightreviewonline.com. Uh, everything's spelled properly there in one big long word, The Light Review Online. You can email John Bullock at jb at thelightreviewonline.com or you can telephone to 01935 812 447. And that's a quick run through of the Light Review Prospectus for 2021. Thanks for listening. Goodbye.